Smith looking for that ball forward, but it only goes as far as Marvin Dalibguchukvu. Plants the ball over the bar. Matty's tail on the turn. He'll get the shot away, Matty's tail. And that is why... But you've got to ask is can you stop it at source in that type of scenario I, I think it can be stopped at Carry with a lovely turn to get away from Robbie Ewer and here is the header back into a dangerous area Scotland are able to get it away temporarily at least Carry to Dip. and how calm is that from Ayman Carr Really good start though from Scotland. This Josh Adam now playing more centrally than he was in the first tie. France. Scotland not making the most of the set piece opportunity, and France will look to create for their under 21s in the EFL Cup against Portsmouth and Crawley Town. It's making it look so casual at times. I'm on carry. Skips away from a couple of Scotland challenges and he clawing at him, trying to get him back. That's a good setup as well for his teammate, Idad Diop. Carry, who is not there, moves first. A couple of players on the sidelines as Murray Johnson's clearance is just sliced high into the air. And to have a vast array of knowledge about every single under 19 side in Europe, however. I would imagine this France side will be there or thereabouts when it comes to the elite rounds and then three times, but like you say, Andre's quality is undoubted. Made his Bordeaux debut. Duncan, and there's Matthew Anderson. And that just sums up the opposition Scotland were facing tonight. Yeah, quite incredible. I mean,